Hello YouTube! Today is the day we're going to do the MERS versus the GMRS two-way radio distance test. And we're going to see which one goes further. I switched out my antenna to the homemade MERS antenna. I did a video on that. So we got that in the same pole, same setup. Now what we're going to do is, let's go inside of here. We're going to do things a little different to keep everything fair and even. Um, I am not going to use the Redivus repeater when it comes time to do the uh, GMRS part of the test. Because I don't want people to say, well, the, G the repeater's got better sensitivity than the handheld. So what we're going to do, here's what we're going to do. We got the handheld hooked up to the laptop as repeater yes I know you're not allowed to use a repeater using the MERS frequencies well for this test this is what I gotta do so this is how we're gonna do this and I got the watt meter hooked up so you can see the SWRs and the wattage and this is we're gonna do the MERS frequency first so the frequency we're doing just so that everyone knows, is the first one on the on the list. I picked it at no particular reason, which is one one fifty one point eight twenty megahertz. So uh, that's the frequency we're doing now, and I'm going to go to the same locations as I did, have done in my previous videos, and that's how we're going to compare this. So um, the, another thing I want to mention. And, I, and I'm going to say this now because I'm going to get a ton of comments. I know for MERS, the maximum wattage is 2 watts. But I can't do that. Unless I buy an attenuator and adjustable attenuator to, to make this all even. The problem is, when I go to the GMRS frequency... I cannot get it to be close to 2 watts. It's either 3.5 or a little over a watt. Yes, I know the difference between 1.2 watt to compared to 2 watt is piddly. And you wouldn't see no difference at all. But I want to keep this as fair as possible. So, believe it or not, with the Redivus handheld... Uh, two-way radios that I'm using on high wattage they're both pretty well equal so uh, so that's what we're gonna do so but I, I'm just saying this now because I know I'm gonna get a, a ton of people saying oh whoa, 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 you can't do five watts well that's the closest I can match everything up so that's what we're gonna do it's just a it's a quick test video we're not gonna run it this way I'm just gonna try to be as fair as possible so here is the um, MERS frequency, which I don't know if you can see that. Let me key up this radio. Maybe it'll... And I have it right there. 1.1 dot... Or 151.8200. And the SWR is 1.01. And it does 5.8 watts. As you can hear, I had the radio keyed up. That's why it recorded and played back. So we're using the software here to do the recording and playing back. Yes, I know you're not allowed to use a repeater for MERS software or MERS frequency, but deal with it. This is how I got to do this. And just a quick test video anyways. So that's what's going on. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to hop in the car. We're going to start doing our um, distance test with the MERS frequency and let's see how it sounds. I'll put you on pause and I'll be right back. Okay guys at the first location and just to let you know we are using a handheld on high power also. This, these, these handhelds are the Rudovitz RT85 model so um, we're doing using that and this is the MERS frequency of 151.820. Technically speaking, 
this should go further than the GMRS frequencies. And I think I mentioned this story before, and I'll mention it again. 20 plus years ago, when they were trying to switch over the county sheriff to um, a different radio uh, setup, the uh, 800 megahertz, and the county did not, it would not work. It was horrible reception. They am going back to the 155 dot some frequency. I can't remember what frequency it is, but uh, that travels better through the trees and the hills and bluffs and all that good stuff. So that's uh, um, a little story there. And that was about 20, 25 years ago. And then I'm going back to the old, the old system. So at any rate, let's go ahead and get on with this and let's do the first location, which is 0.8 miles away from the repeater as the crow flies, as a bird flies. Radio check, one, two, three, four. Radio check, one, two, three, four. Check, one, two, three, four. Radio check, one, two, three, four. So there you have it. Sounds great. 0.8 miles away. Let's go to the next location, and I'll put you on pause, and we'll be right with you. Okay, guys, location two, using the MERS frequency. Um, I'll probably make this to be a two-part video because it gets to be kind of long trying to do it as one. I'm going to try to shoot it the same day. As you can tell with the weather, you know, it's, it's, it's um, some clouds, uh, as you can see in the video. So, at any rate, this is location two. This is going to be 1.37 miles away as the crow flies. Radio check, one, two, three, four. Radio check, one, two, three, four. Check, one, two, three, four. Radio check, one, two, three, four. There you have it. Sounds good. We're going to go to the next location. So I'm going to put you on pause and we'll be right back. Okay, this is going to be Location 3, 1.5 miles away as the crow flies. Here we go. Radio check, 1, 2, 3, 4. Radio check, 1, 2, 3, 4. 1, 2, 3, 4. Radio check, 1, 2, 3, 4. Sounding good. I think we'll go to the next location. Um... And I'm going to put you on pause, and we'll be right back. Okay, this is going to be location uh, four, I believe. This is about two miles away as the crow flies. If I remember right, with the GMRS, it was kind of sketchy. Even when I ran the 20-watt um, repeater and when I did it stock repeater, it, Stock appears a little bit better if I remember right, but it was kind of sketchy here. So let's uh, go ahead and try. This is, like I said before, this is the MERS frequency. Let's give it a try. Radio check, one, two, three, four. Radio check, one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Radio check, one, two, three, four. That sounds pretty good. Now, if you didn't notice, there's no squelch break at the end because we're not using a repeater per se. We're using software, so you don't hear the the no, shh at the end when I unkey. So just to explain that. Let's do it one more time. Radio check. One, two, three, four. Radio check. One, two, three, four. Check. One, two, three, four. Radio check. One, two, three, four. Sounds pretty good. So let's go to the next location, and I will put you on pause, and we'll be right back. Okay, guys, at location oh, five, I think it is. I'm losing track. But at any rate, this, look, this one is 2.9 miles away. Um, we're using the MERS frequency. Let's see how it sounds from here. Radio check, one, two, three, four. Radio check, one, two, three, four.
Well, we'll try it again. Radio check. One, two, three, four. Radio check. One, two, three, four. Nope. Nothing. I'm going to try it one more time. Radio check. One, two, three, four, four, three, two, one. Nope. So we're going to go to the other location, which is a tad bit closer. We'll try it there. Um, I'm going to put you on pause, and we'll be right back. Okay, right before I was going to leave, I thought I'd try it one more time, and I did hit the repeater. I'm still at the same location, 2.91 miles away. Let's see if I can do it here real quick. Radio check, 1, 2, 3, 3, 2, 1. Okay, so I had to kind of reposition myself in the car, but I am, I can hit it. It's a little touchy, but I'm still in the car. I'm not out of the car. Try it one more time. Radio check, one, two, three, four, four, three, two, one. Four, three, two, one. Staticky, but... I think if I was outside the car, it, it might be, you know, might be a tad bit better. But we are hitting the repeater at 2.91 miles away. This is the MERS frequency of 151.820 with my homemade antenna um, that's got pretty decent S SWRs, as you saw in the beginning of the video. Let's try it one more time. Radio check, 1, 2, 3, 4. Radio check, 1, 2, 3, 4. So there you have it. We, we're hitting it. Um, yeah, you know, but we are hitting it. So let's go to the other location and see if that's a little bit better. I'll put you on pause and we'll be right back. And I, as I'm driving to the next location, I'd like to add something that I know people may say. And they may say, well, you're using a homemade antenna. That You can't really compare that to the, to the other antenna that you bought that's for the GMRS frequency and you don't know what the gain is of the antenna that you made well that is true I do not know the gain of the antenna I do know the SWRs are good um, I built it according to the antenna calculator so that's all I can say about it um, is the gain equal to the one that I bought for the GMRS frequency I don't know um, there could be a little bit of a difference there. That's very possible. But uh, I just thought I'd kind of point that out, that I am aware of that. And um, so keep that in mind, too, that uh, antennas, uh, w one's bought and one's made. So, um, But at any rate, I thought I'd, I'd add that tidbit before I forget. On to the next location. I'll put you on pause, and when I get there, we will chat again. Okay, guys, we're at the other location now, 2.12 miles away. This is in a different direction compared to the last uh, location we were at. Let's do a quick radio check and see if she works. Radio check, 1, 2, 3, 4, 4, 3, 2, 1. Radio check. 1, 2, 3, 4, 4, 3, 2, 1. Radio check. Sounds pretty good. Um, actually, it's not bad for being a homemade antenna. I think it's working really good. Um, let's do it one more time. Radio check. One, two, three, four, four, three, two, one. Check. One, two, three, four, four, three, two, one. That's not bad. That's not bad at all, actually. So, this, this has been the MERS distance test using the MERS frequency as I said before the 
0.820. Not too bad. Um, so now we're going to end the video here. I'm going to go back and we're going to reconfig for the GMRS frequency. Um, this is this video here is part one. We're going to do part two, hopefully the same day, and I will let you know in the video if it is the same day. If you have any questions or comments, please post them down below, and please subscribe. Thank you.